Hey lads, welcome back to another video. This is a very chilled video. I just wanted to show you what I just got from um, car boot sale. Me and Alexa just went to two car boot sales today, this morning. It was an early day. Oh my God, I've taken my makeup off. I hope you don't mind my bare face. I think they're all friends here. I think you don't mind. We basically went to two different car boot sales. If you're in Suffolk, we went to the Woolpit one and then we went to Stolen Barnes and I won't lie to you, the Woolpit one served me the most sauce. There's a lot, I bought a lot of stuff, but I didn't even spend 30 pounds. Sorry, excuse me? So yeah, we'll get straight into it. There's some sick, sick stuff. I think I went a bit insane. I had a marvelous time and I can't wait to do another one. Me and Alexa are actually thinking we're going to film a like, thrifting, what do we call it? Tiny town thrifting, that's what we called it. Um, so basically, me and Alexa are basically gonna be going to lots of tiny towns and we're going to rifle through all the charity shops and show you like our finds. I think it's quite fun, you know, all of these like shops are opening back up again, but I think what is really fun is like sometimes just rifling through like the charity shops and seeing what sick stuff you can find particularly in the men's section. But anyway, what I'll do is I'll show you the stuff that I've got today. I've got some bargains, my friends. What I'll show you first is this gorgeous necklace I got from a girl, I can't remember. I've got her business card, so I'll pop like her details on the screen and down below. She's got a, she's got a website and she's got an Instagram. She said, oh, I'm terrible at Instagram. Oh, I can't do social media. Um, but she's got a website and I'm hoping I can buy more stuff off of her because they were so, so sick. So, I got this bracelet, bracelet, necklace. I got this necklace and it's so, so sick. Look, I know you're getting a close up of my um, spots, but also you're getting a close up of this gorgeous necklace. And I got it for three pounds, bargain. And then also she had like a little stand for earrings and they had the cutest earrings on there. And some I got were these little, like heart ones and they've got these go this gorgeous sort of like beading on the top and then just little purple hearts they're gonna be so so cute i can't wait to wear them i've obviously got hoops in at the minute so i won't take put them in but absolutely love them a pound i'm sorry a pound i don't know why i didn't buy more there and then i'm gonna go and find her again and i'm gonna go i'm gonna i'm gonna raid her shop I'm gonna buy all of her stock <laughs> and then this is then gonna lead me on to the next thing because I feel like um, earrings give me groovy chick vibes. Do you know what else I got there? Groovy chick twister. I know I probably won't play this and I might just be having it for the sake of having it, but um, I'm hoping I can get a bit of use out of it when like we all start meeting up with family, friends and things like that because we do play like quite a lot of games for like when we have family around and stuff, like events. So I'm going to clean it first obviously because twister i don't know what i'll do with it maybe just like anti-back it or something but for a pound i got it for a pound i'm sorry i got it, i got it for a pound then we'll get on to the clothing there's actually something else i basically got a mirror i'll like put some scenes get some scenes for you of it literally got it for like two or three pounds i think and i want to basically get some like sick photos of it in my bedroom um i basically got this one here at the moment that if I get photos at home I'll just use that but I think the circular one could be quite a fun sort of like I don't know it's just it's circular I feel like that's quite exciting or is that just weird might just be weird might just be me the next thing I purchased she's got a north face she's got an in real life north face it's not it's like a half zip up situation there was red and then there was also this one but i feel like this one's more sort of like versatile at the moment with like some crazy leggings or some crazy trousers i feel like it would go quite nice a treat i think it'd go down a treat again i think what size is it an l slash g so i assume that's a large um and yeah it's proper north face lads it's proper proper north face for two or three pounds excuse me saucy scenes and then i got this little t-shirt 
which I'm thinking I might crop. I might like cut the bottom off and then like wear it with some like denim shorts or just some jeans or maybe my trousers I've got on at the minute, my little like crazy trousers, I might wear those. I got it in a size. I got it in a size. I think I'm so used to saying that. <laughs> I obviously can't get it in any other sizes. It's a car boot sale. There weren't any other sizes available. I love it. I think the green's really spicy. Very nice indeed. And then I got a lot of shirts. So I got this shirt, Maggie's having a meltdown, but yes, this is in a size large and it's from a brand called Champion. It's a Champion shirt, which I really, really like. Again, it's in a large, I've already said that, um, but I really like the pattern and I wanted to use them as like sort of like oversized shirts to put over like shorts with like shorts on the top. It could be like a little thing to put over put some sandals on, a little summer vibe. I also got another shirt. Again, she is a medium, regular fit from Next. I assume these are like male shirts from like the smart section, but these were both like two or three pounds tops. Can't go wrong, can't go wrong. Now this is one of the funny ones because, see that there? That's a pink stripy shirt. I just got it from ASOS for 20 pounds. What did I find at the car boot sale? A pink shirt. Guess how much I paid for it? Two pounds. So that's going back. <laughs> I've still, I've got something I want to send back anyway. I only got this yesterday. Um, and I was like, I accidentally bought two. So I'm sending that one back anyway, but I'll send that one back as well now because I've got a pink stripy top that, um, a pink stripy shirt that I literally paid two pounds for. Can't go wrong. Yes, again, can't go wrong. And I'm gonna wear this with like all of my funky trousers, again with shorts and like a little top underneath. It's gonna be so cute. I can't wait. And then, one of the last things, I got this one from, I didn't get much, so that was all from Woolpit. No, the earrings and the necklace wasn't from Woolpit. These were from the Ston and Barnes one that's in like Stone Market way. Um, but I then got this little like denim shirt which I think was really cute I haven't tried any of this on yet so I'm hoping that it fits I think this all will because most of it's been men's but this is the only thing that's women's and it's like it's a UK large but it's River Island and I'm not sure if it's going to um I'm not sure if it's going to fit but yeah this is what the print looks like so it's sort of the thing that Jaded London and you know brands like that would like release now for like triple the price like I paid a pound for this it's going to set you back at least 30 quid if it was from any other place. So I'm very lucky with that respect, but I don't know how I'm going to style it yet. Maybe I'll do like a little cutaway of me like styling all of these things so you can sort of like see what the vibe is that I'm going to go for. Um, but yeah, that's all for clothing. However, Alexa talked me into getting some fabric. So this woman had something else as well as this that I bought from her. I can't remember what it was. Um, but basically, I got this fabric. There's so much of it. Look, there's so much of it. She basically said that it was her mum's, but she sold it to me for a fiver. A fiver. Um, so obviously, I'm keeping it, thank you. But what I wanted to do was, um, my mum said that apparently my, my nan sews. She used to sew and make clothes so I'm gonna drop her a message very soon I might drop her a message in a minute and ask her if she can make me some funky like flared trousers like the ones I've got now wait 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 I might ask her if she can make some of these with this fabric I don't know if I've got enough for her to like make them really nice and like thick because this is quite thin but we shall see. I really, really hope it does. I hope it can. But yeah, fiver. Can't go wrong. I might even like make a little cute top out of it or something. I really hope I can get trousers out of it. That'd be so sick if we could. They are all of the pieces. Again, I'll like show you the mirror. The mirror will obviously be in the cutaway. Um, and that is everything. So I hope you enjoyed that little like car boot sale haul. Um, it's quite fun. It was actually quite fun like going through and having like a little sift the morning. I can't believe I got up that early. But yeah, as I said, me and Alexa are gonna start like a little sort of like 
tiny town thrifting that's what we're gonna call it that's the series i think she's gonna film some and i'm definitely gonna film some for mine um and basically we're gonna go to every different town it's gonna be different town different episode so we'll come to like my town and do the charity shops there we'll go to her town do the charity shops there then we'll go to like other towns we want to go to beckles because we've been there before for charity shopping and that was actually quite good and there's also a really sick cafe come garden center there called but yeah, let me know uh, if you're excited to see that. I'm very excited. And other than that, I'll catch you soon. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, smash a like, subscribe, and I shall catch you soon for another video. Very sooner than you think. Bye.